people really loving the lobster dress. Thanks, Ray. I appreciate it. I hope it's a hit back there. Yeah. They said they love the lobster dress, yeah. right? Okay. So, if you don't know, now you're going to know. This is a Hyannis native, best-selling author, Casey Sherman, just wrapping up another book, book number 18, Blood in the Water, yep. about the Nathan Carmen case, which was such a wild story to cover. And, and, and it's a crazier story than anybody even knows about, so I'm very excited to get that book out uh, April of next year. I am excited to read that one. Now... You are from here many generations. Seven generations here in Hyannis. All right. We're going to test your knowledge. Oh, boy. Generations deep here of your hometown. So question number one okay. here of our town trivia is, what famous soup company owns Hyannis-based Cape Cod potato chips? Sure. Mm-mm. Good. <laughs> All right. I would have to say Campbell Soup. Was, it, right. was it the tell? Was it yeah, the tell? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you for the prompt there. I very appreciate good, that. Very good. Very good. Uh, number two, author Kurt Vonnegut once lived on the Cape and was prominently featured in your book, Helltown. What make of cars did he sell while trying to make ends meet? Hmm, that's a tough one. Let's see. Saab, I believe it was. Yes. Number two, two for All two. Right, yeah. All right. Here we go, number three. Hopefully we can trick you on one. Okay. The Kennedys are the first family of Hyannis Port, and JFK once famously said, ask not what your country can do for you, ask... What you can do for your country. It's a multiple choice one, but you do not even need the choices. <laughs> and one of the options was directions to your local gas station. Oh, yeah. He oh, did not. I'm sure he said that. <laughs> maybe, yeah. maybe. A little more eloquently. Right. All right, how about number four? The Hyannis Harbor Hawks. They're the local entry into the Cape Cod Baseball League. What was the team nickname from 1976 until 2010 when they became the Harbor Hawks. They were the Hyannis Mets and I used to watch them uh, play every summer. Well done. Well done. All right. We're four for four. All Let's right, go with number five here. Number five. What was the name of the popular Hyannis nightclub named for a steam engine can also be used to describe someone who feels a little bloated in the gut? Oh, boy. Um, puffer bellies. There you go. Boy. Jeez. Five for five. We're wow. going to get some tougher questions out that here. Out Nicely done. And <laughs> for it. that, you're going to get this amazing oh, gift bag All of right. B25 goodies. Fantastic. I'm going to bring this to my mom, who lives oh. right down the street. <laughs> perfect. Perfect. Tell her I said hello. I will. Say Thank hi you to your mother much. for me, right? <laughs> Thank you so much. Let's send it back to Kev.